So in this video I'll be describing how to convert a device that uses RF um, frequency to communicate um, to using um, the Amazon Alexa or Google Home uh, using the Broadlink RM Pro. So this device is a uh, blind opener uh, which I've created, uh, details to which are in some separate videos and via at Thingiverse. Um, the links to which I'll put in the description below um, and it basically works using um, an RF, there's an RF receiver um, and this is the transmitter so um, if I press and hold um, I can open and then close the blinds uh, which just saves me having to use the buttons uh, which do essentially the same thing but I don't really want to use this device to control um, to control the blinds. I'd rather use my phone and or um, Amazon Alexa. So uh, we can use Alexa um, in combination with the Broadlink RM Pro to achieve this. And this is what I'm going to uh, describe in this video. Um, I'll add a link in the description to where you can buy the RM Pro. Um, they tend to be around 30 or 40 pounds um, and they're used to imitate uh, signals, RF signals from receivers like this. Uh, they'll also imitate uh, infrared signals as well so you can use them to control things like televisions, stereos, um, etc. So I'll just start by showing it in action. Alexa, turn off the kitchen blinds. Alexa, turn on the kitchen blinds. Okay. So the first thing to do is to install the um, Intelligent Home Center Broadlink app, which is in the Google Play Store. Uh, annoyingly, you have to give this app quite a lot of access. So you might want to read through and check that you're happy to do that. So then you need to um, sign up or log in to the Intelligent Home Centre app. Once you've logged in, your devices that are already installed on your network should appear. Uh, so in this case, I have an RM Pro. If they don't, you'll want to follow the instructions on the app. So I've clicked the RM Pro and then I'm going to pick an appliance type. Uh, I'm going to use the lamp type just purely because I've had problems with some of the other types. Um, and it doesn't really matter what you're using. It should still work with Alexa. Uh, give it a name. Uh, this is the name you refer to it in Alexa eventually. So name it as you require. Give it a location, and then you need to learn the code, or the let the RM Pro learn the code. So you follow the instructions, and basically you select the corresponding button, or sorry, you press the corresponding button whilst aiming your remote at the Broadlink RM Pro. The light is orange when it's in programming mode, and will turn off once it's learned a command. And then you can test whether that command has been stored correctly in the Broadlink app. And then you do the same for any of the buttons you want to control. So for the light, there's some brightness options, uh, which you can skip. Uh, so in this case, I'm just programming the on and the off button to open and close the blinds. Once that's done, you should then be able to use the app to control the device. Now you want to install the Alexa skill. So load the Alexa app and go to skills and search for Broadlink. And then you will enable the Broadlink skill and link it to your Broadlink account that you set up with the Intelligent Home Center app. So 
in this case I already had the skill configured. Now you need to go to the smart home section in the Alexa app and click add device and this will search for new devices uh, that you've configured in the Intelligent Home Center app and configure them for working with the Alexa. You can also do this by simply asking the Alexa to discover devices uh, it does the same thing and then your new devices should appear in the smart home section. Alexa, discover devices. Starting discovery. This will take up to 20 seconds. If you haven't already, please enable the smart home skill for your smart device from the Alexa app. I found one new light called kitchen blinds. To control it, say, turn off kitchen blinds. So you should then be able to control the device from the Alexa app in the smart home section. And finally, you should be able to control it with voice commands. Alexa, turn off the kitchen blinds. Alexa, turn on the kitchen blinds. And that's it. And in theory, this should work for any RF controlled device.